cost is the process of identifying the cost of providing a defined unit of service or product. Now I am providing service. If you pay pen, purchase pen or bag, it's a goods. So it's a process. So when you are calculating any service or product, you have to take full process of that activity and then calculate. For example, example, I'm coming to that your education. When you started, when you end, how much you are investing for that? That's a full cost you have to calculate. Why we need uh, uh, costing? It's a measure of resources that are used. Why the resources are limited? Can we increase 24 hours to 25, at least 24.1? Then there is a value. You think when you are investing, you have to think about the value for that resource. And again, price, what the individual are charged for that. Today, my time is <laughs> charged. Somebody is paying for my time. What's the purpose? Why we need costing? The previous, you may be know the today, health technology assessment, economic evaluation, all these things. How to do, it will take time. Definitely you will learn one day what are the types of economic evaluation, how we can do it. So if you want to do this economic evaluation, maybe costing, cost effectiveness, cost utility, cost benefit, that one side is a costing. You should know what is costing. If you are not estimate properly the costing, it may be underestimated, overestimated. If you are in the company, it will be very easy to measure. I am investing this much, this much is sales, this much is a profit. But the two important sectors, health and education, very difficult to measure. That's why people are not much interested to, to enter in this field, do this type of analysis. So Government of India, ICMR is given the responsibility to at least develop this capacity in this field so more people can do and improve this sector of health and education. But we have taken the responsibility for the health sector. This is very important when we do the economic evaluations, we should know the costing. Then there are, when we do the costing uh, or economic evaluation, first the research costing and for example, again, why the symposium? What is the cost? Whether it's worth? What is the effect? What is the utility? What is the benefit? First research question is, why this symposium? Then you have to assess the cost and then effect. Then adjust, today, today uh, the 1940s money is not equal to today's money. So you have to see the value and adjust that the value when, when the time when you are doing the analysis. And again, uncertainty, everything's uncertainty. So many uncertainties, uncertainties are there. Then you have to adjust that. Then finally you make the decision. Why costing study, what it will say? Whether affordable. Can I buy mobile for 1.5 lakh? That price will tell the affordability of that goods. Can I go for some heart uh, surgery for one crore? So costing is very important to answer the affordable, affordability of, it may be individual, it may be the country, it may be the system. Then the budget impact, what it will say, budget impact analysis, sustainability. We are seeing government is not spending so much of money for the health. Can we increase the 50% of the budget to the health sector? So the sustainability, the next year what they will do? So sustainability. It should be every year should spend money. Then another one, epidemiological it imp and the disease burden and the value for money and price setting will say the threshold analysis. These are the different types of analysis will answer the questions of let's say, affordability, all these things. Then again, we can go for costing for macro, micro or industry and the government perspective and measurement. Uh, uh, there are different types of cost. Then. When, when we do the costing analysis, you see the full path of that thing. For example, diagnosis, when people get the disease, they have to first shopping for diagnosis to confirm their diagnosis. For that, it's, we are saying now people are not going to the hospital. People go to the hospital, the confirmation, we need a diagnostic tool, correct tool to diagnosis. Then say, uh, we, are, we are doing the sensitive correct tool, correct, in time, 
that is very important then that that time they spend lot of money then diagnosis involved the cost treatment involved the cost then up to the this you have to take full this course if what we are doing only diagnosis cost or only treatment cost only shopping for diagnosis cost will be there if full course you want to uh, uh, calculate you have to take full path and you can estimate the cost and there are two type of cost medical and non medical cost medical cost involved consultation investigation drugs and the non medical is travel lodging special food for the patient perspective so again direct cost direct cost which easily traced money we can visibly see can money but indirect cost it's very difficult time for example patient visit to the hospital their time they will lose their uh, uh, day income all these things it's indirect cost then still intangible cost is there i don't know how many people are sitting the the madam is here if you go out madam will call after some time this is cold so many pain suffering worries same thing will happen to the patient also no so much of pain will be there that and all is very difficult to measure it but when we do the costing this also needs to be considered you don't look into only the costing other factor also needs to be considered these are the intangible cost then fixed and variable cost the hospital many things already build we are not when we implement anything new we are not going for the fixed or capital cost only the recurring cost will be there then we need to do the costing analysis which cost you are taking into consideration there are two cost fixed and uh, variable cost and financial and economic cost the recurrent and capital cost then total cost will include everything and full cost uh, it includes allocated sash for example in the health system it's very difficult to calculate because it's integrated for example if i want to do the tp cost it is integrated in the primary health center they have do lot of things then it's very difficult to take their share for the tb services then you, you have to calculate the total cost when we do the uh, costing these are the steps steps we need to consider first identify the relevant resources used quantify the resources and uh, uh, you also need to consider the opportunity cost uh, uh, and the uh, timing and adjust the timing sometimes the invest may be investment may be 5 years before when you take into cost consideration this year then we need to adjust cost for that then uh, measurement this activity based and the, when we do the costing again it's a money involved people will not able to tell the cost or we may be overestimate we have to be very careful and quality check is very important when we do the costing analysis and these are the some uh, example i am showing we have done the tb diagnosis this activity based we have done for the Uh, community and again registration for the cost consultation what is the cost investigation what is the cost and finally get the result so these are the activities we need to consider and each activity these are the uh, resources used then we can calculate the cost and there are two methods top down method and uh, bottom up approach then top down you can take the average bottom up just you count from that for timing uh, time how much time they spend then calculate that cost is a bottom up and the perspective two perspective patient perspective and health system perspective means that patient also spending money from their pocket government also spending money so you have to consider both side otherwise one side their out of pocket expenditures reducing what it mean you have to see the government is held, held government is spending government is maybe the same cost government is spending more to reduce the out of pocket expenditure to the government the average cost may be the same so we have to look into that both side then health system perspective we need to consider all this their direct uh, medical and non medical and indirect cost when you do the health system perspective uh, and uh, health system we need to take into consideration lab consumables staff salary outpatient and inpatient treatment regimen cost in, in addition to the social support cost for example many programs now they are getting incentives tb program patients are getting 500 rupees reproductive health uh, uh, that uh, pregnant women are getting money when we do the cost analysis that also needs to be considered then overhead cost watchman also very important when you do the uh, costing you can't ignore the watchman electricity water many things also it will come under the overhead then this is this again patient perspective many people may know that they have to go for shopping and they will spend money borrow money all this. there are lot of studies and the people talk uh, many on this out of pocket expenditure this topic is getting very important again there is a goal for globally patient should not incur cost that's why this insurance scheme is coming more, um, very important to reduce 
patient cost and again another logo uh, there is a need for the um, protective measures to the financial protective measures to the patients to be implemented uh, these are the parameters when we do the costing for the patient out of pocket expenditure and again another term catastrophic health expenditure i hope that out of pocket expenditure individual or family patients spend money from their pocket that's out of pocket expenditure then if they are spending their income for example what is your family expenditure per month anybody counted any idea how much family expenditure per month what is the proportion to income you are spending per month then in that how much you are spending for health if you are spending more than 10% some people consider it as a catastrophic if you are spending 20% more catastrophic 30% catastrophic it means it's a some dangerous sign you are spending more for health but for again madam said now we have like service curative preventive if you are spending preventive it's a good but for for the treatment then that will be the more catastrophic in nature then adjustment how you can adjust based on the life of that uh, uh, machine you have to take into consideration depreciation and inflation you know that money value then take this is the formula you have to do the discounting reporting then uh, again presentation also today you may be seen na uh, different people will differently present and attract the people in the casting is very difficult it's a number so you have to present it in very attractive way i will go some few and you are all youngsters you may be more creative than me you can present it in creative way to make the people to understand if you say that people are spending 10% people doesn't make oh so what people if you say that 50% you oh my god 50% you are spending like that you would say then only it will go to their mind so something like then then measurement pre- unit cost you have to do total cost average cost marginal cost incremental cost incremental cost effectiveness ratio but these are all need some formulas <laughs> you have to read it's not possible me to explain now then these are some table forms some graph it's a very simple you can say that it is attractive way to present the policy maker see what we are hearing today health technology assessment economic evaluation you are going to you are thinking high like you are going to meet policy makers program managers decision makers if you say so many numbers they don't have a time to listen you have to give some very simple like tb is killing people they will listen covid is rapidly spreading they will listen if you say so much of things they won't listen they don't have a time also so we have to present it in very attractive way something you say you know that oh, what is this very lengthy line what is the big number something like you can highlight in attractive way we can present these are the some examples Thank you.